Melvin's had such a, a great uh, season on the defense. He might not be able to play this week with that foot. Uh, how much does it impress on the rest of you guys that you got to pick up uh, where he might not be able to play? Uh, we got to pick it up uh, a whole lot, not having Melvin out there on the field. Hopefully he can get back, but if, if not, I think Jadavion and all the other ends will do a great job on filling this. There's a lot of uh, big shoes to fill, but yeah, I think they'll get the job done. DJ, with uh, Devontae moving back to the boundary, you've obviously moved back over to free. Is there either that you prefer, and how's the transition gone for you? You've pretty much learned both positions. Yeah, I learned both positions. And it's, um, having him back there, both of us played last year. We got uh, good experience back there. Me and him communicate very well together. So it's a plus having him back there with me. DJ, was there any frustration at all among the defensive guys? You kept having to go back out on the field. Offense couldn't get anything moving. You guys were – Kept getting called on to make stops. Was it how tough was that on you? I mean, championship defense got to make stops when it, when the offense special teams need them, and um, we in it as a team. So you know, if the uh, offense need to be picked up, the defense is there for them, and vice versa. DJ, talk a little bit about Antonio Allen and and the kind of season that he's having. Um, Antonio is a. Uh, ball hawk out there on the field. You know, he makes a lot of <laughs> big stops on third down. Um, we, uh, Antonio is a good player. He's playing good, and he will continue to play good. Are you guys motivated at all by what happened in the second half of that Kentucky game last year in Lexington? Most definitely. You know, we let that game slip away from us last year. And, you know, that's still in the back of our minds. So, you know, we're just practicing hard, you know, not, not let that happen this year. Can you talk about your play specifically and as well as uh, Kelsey? I mean, a couple of Greenwood guys that, you know, maybe not the headliners on this on this defense, but certainly guys that w when you're in the game, you seem to always be around the ball. Yes, sir. You know, me and Kelsey, you know, from Greenwood, you know, we always, you know, our coach always told us to go full speed no matter what the cost may be. And, you know, we just, you know, players that got roles on this defense, and, you know, we play our role with the best ability that we can. And we're doing just that.